We need to pray for Pope Francis and the Catholic Church in general. And then we need to pray for every Pope, every Patriarch, and every church leader. Because what is happening in the church, very sad. Very sad. Very sad. Stop being boastful about your doctorates. My dear friends, the only time you should boast when you say, I know the Lord, I don't just believe in Him, I know Him. Church leader, do you know the Lord? Don't tell me you went and studied at this university and you got your doctorates. Big deal. Satan can devour you and you won't even know what hit you if you've got your doctorate. If you don't put your head under the feet and the sandals of Jesus Christ, you have no chance, my dear friend, even if you're a pope. You have no chance. Satan is much smarter than you, much wiser than you. The only one who overcame Satan is Jesus Christ of Nazareth, not the pope, not the cardinal, not the bishop, no one, the Lord. No wonder the church is in turmoil because church leaders of great influence positions, they only speak about the Lord, they don't know Him. I don't want to talk much because they might say, oh, look at this guy, he's trying to be a show off or something. I'm not, please. We need to pray for Pope Francis and the Catholic Church in general. And then we need to pray for every Pope, every Patriarch, and every church leader. Because what is happening in the church, very sad. Very sad. Very sad. If any church comes to this level and say that we need to embrace LGBTQ, R, S, T, U, V, Y, Z, X, Y, I don't know what else, and it is absolutely normal and it's not against the biblical teachings, that is no longer a church and that leader is not a leader anymore no matter who he is, what he is, I don't really give one penny. There are things outside your jurisdiction, church leader. You are not above the Lord Jesus. Do you understand? You're not. And the Lord will reprimand. Don't ever think that Jesus Christ is all, only love and only mercy. No, no, no. He can be very harsh when he comes to punish. Oh yeah, he can be very harsh. And he's the only true powerful God ever in existence if you if something Satan is powerful Satan is nothing compared to what Jesus Christ of Nazareth can do nothing Satan is absolutely a little mouse when the line of Judah comes along he becomes a little mouse Be gone, Satan. 